Hey, good morning. I have a question for you. What generally stops us from performing really at anything, at any level we're trying to perform at, uh, trying to do what we know we can do, but, but we always find a reason to rationalize our way out of this. Well, I want to talk about that today. Um, this is a concept that you'll find in my new book, Start With a Win, and uh, it's, it's called the Pike Syndrome. So typically what stops us is self-limiting beliefs, self-limiting beliefs. It's the, uh, you know, I can't, I, I shouldn't, I, I don't want to, what, I don't know. It doesn't matter what your, your rationalized excuse is for your self-limiting beliefs, but the reality is it's, it's nature. It's nature. It's like training a dog that they can't do something. They won't do it. So um, here's, here's the reality. Uh, 150 years ago, uh, German scientist Carl Mobius decided he was going to test a theory and see whether or not we could create self-limiting beliefs. And what he did was he put a pike, which is like this big predator fish, in a tank. And then he put some minnows in there. And what, what does the pike do with the minnows? It eats it. It loves minnows. So pike goes in, predator eats the, the little the minnows, and, and sure enough, you know, all is well. Well, then Carl put a clear barrier in the tank and on one side of the barrier was the pike and he put the minnows on the other side and the the pike's like oh minnows guess what i'm gonna do goes after him hits the barrier just hammers the barrier over and over again and decides i can't get to these minnows so stops trying the pike stops trying so carl removes this clear barrier and the minnow starts swimming around the pike and the pike doesn't eat the minnows why it believes it can't even though it could. So this is this is a an example of self-limiting beliefs. We always put these invisible barriers in front of us in life. Maybe we failed at something once, twice, 10 times, who knows what it is, but the reality is self-limiting beliefs and these invisible barriers that we perceive to be true are what prevent us from performing at the level that we can actually perform at. Because I got news for you. You're capable of so much more than you believe you are. Okay. You're capable of so much more than you believe you are. And we always find a reason or an excuse to limit ourselves. And that might be, um, let's say I, I talk to a lot of people in real estate. Okay. And I'm the CEO of Remax and I talk to a ton of people and a lot of people operate within this price range. They place themselves in this clear barrier that says, here's my price range that I operate in. And then they go to do a listing presentation for, you know, something that's twice that price. And they're all a mess about the whole thing simply because they have these self-limiting beliefs. Same thing with recruiting. If you're a broker owner, I, I can't, you know, make more than this many calls a day, or I can't get that person to come over to my office, whatever it is. Come on, let's stop holding ourselves back. And uh, don't be that pike. You know what happened to that pike? He starved to death. The pike starved to death after it decided it couldn't eat those minnows. So there's a lesson here. What are your self-limiting beliefs? What are those invisible barriers that you put in front of yourself? Write them down. Take a look at them and then cross them off because they're not true and go out and conquer those. So that's the uh, thought I have for you today. Um, if you'd like to pre-order the book, all author proceeds from the sale of the book. Uh, so I'm not going to make anything on the sale of this book. I don't intend to. This is something that I'm trying to make an impact with, not a profit. Um, all author proceeds are going to be donated to Children's Miracle Network Hospitals, one of my favorite charities. Let's help the kids. So uh, anyhow, you can pre-order on the link below. Have a wonderful day. Let's get rid of those self-limiting beliefs. Think about Carl and the Pike. No clear barriers in front of you. Go do it. Have a great one.